Hello everyone, Ksenia Mia Brigilovsky. It's uh, February the 9th, 4.25 a.m. I am still out of 106 Montcalm in Vaughan. Another video documentation slash uh, thinking on the site about uh, how it is that I am, um, to the best of my knowledge, fully capable, not completely dumb, um, on a spectrum or not. Uh, I feel I'm capable uh, to provide for myself and earn an income uh, and being able to afford a normal roof and over my head and uh, standard of living. Um, that is the standard of living in the country uh, I reside in. I get to deal and face the mistakes of my mother and my father and my uh, country of birth. Why it is that I am at 38 after being dragged through the mud, being discriminated in every single job I was in, only for being born in a certain uh, geographical area, only having certain uh, facial features and characteristics, only being judged uh, by my mother and her spouse, only being judged by their uh, qualities, characteristics and capabilities, being judged by whatever it is that my biological father uh, did or did not do at the time when he fled, uh, so to speak. Uh, why I have to face the music? That's what I don't understand. I had a mother and a father. When I was born, I had two people who contributed their genetic material to create me as a human being, right? So I went to kindergarten, I went to school, I got educated, extracurricular activities, etc., etc., etc. I come here and I'm being dragged through the mud. I don't want to see ladies with chignons and hairs uh, parading themselves in front of me. What is it? You don't know me. You don't know what I'm coming from, what kind of pains and aches and shit I went through in life so that you can parade yourself with your chignons and hairs in front of me like an imbecile. Why I'm being touched by uh, on my boobs by impersonated doctors, why I'm being shot into a psych ward, I don't understand why I'm being subjected to all this incivilities and indignities. I don't understand. If you have a problem with me, why don't you say it? Hey, Mia, um, you know what? We have all of these certain uh, things that are not working out, but this is the path that will uh, benefit you the most. And please be it legit, all right? I am not here. I have not come to Canada to work for whatever intelligence, intelligence agencies or to incriminate myself by association with this or that, uh, being uh, dehumanized, discriminated against, uh, shoved into situations where I am being treated and spoken down to like an imbecile or some sort of uh, perpetrator of this or that. At 38 years of age, I expect myself being able to integrate into a working professional lifestyle and provide for myself. I don't understand what is so difficult about that. I speak the language, I can educate myself further, I've already gotten some sort of education, whatever artificial intelligence that you are giving out to immigrants uh, here to either make fun of them or uh, to sort of use us, and I say us because I was not born in here, I don't have the wide networks of uh, privileges and uh, elites to, you know, just call up favors on, etc., etc. So I am on my own and fencing for myself. I don't have anyone to sort of connect, protect, etc., etc. I've been paying all of that uh, uh, in taxes, property taxes, etc., etc. Okay, so I'm here at 38 years of age. No family, no life, no friends, no work. And I'm still fencing for my rights to get standard of living, 
to get my health back on track, to get uh, my professional life back on track. I don't understand why I was forced out of every single job. First of all, I understand why I was forced out of, out of every single job, because I was in ghetto placements in every single job. I get uh, all these Eastern European uh, uh, ladies or white ladies who think that I am an immigrant, and so I uh, am a priori uh, from the get-go disqu uh, disqualified from anything and everything that I am uh, uh, coming off weird in social settings. That's right, because I have nothing in common with you, with your experiences of helicopter parenting and going uh, to school in the buses and being called uh, cupcakes and uh, birthday parties, etc., etc. No, no, you, ha you know nothing about me, all right? So yeah, I have my own insecurities, okay? So, and don't try to... Um, sort of create romantic situations of sorts or introduce me to um, culturally foreign, again, I will use the same word, culturally foreign environments where I have nothing in common with people. I am five, eight and a half. I am a heavy belt. I consider myself I'm nearly 150 pounds, 145, 150, all right? So, I'm white, I speak English, I am professionally minded and career oriented. I don't understand why I'm being constantly shoved from one place to another place and be treated as an assistant uh, girl um, for this or that, okay? Uh, so again, this is my outreach and plea to international authorities. Uh, 60th or 70th video communication that I'm posting on YouTube to take me out of harm's way and to stop incriminating me by association or by intention, all right? I want a normal life. I want a normal professional life, uh, public life, social life. I don't understand what I have done or what my parents might have done for me to deserve all these struggles.